Hi, it's Matt Plaska from One Week Bath with another edition in our series of short videos on bathroom design, product selection, and remodeling. And today we're going to talk about the pros and cons associated with installing a doorless shower in your bathroom. It's another edition of Soak It Up with Matt Plaskoff, bathroom design and remodeling. A doorless walk-in or curbless shower offers some advantages over a traditional shower stall. However, before you decide to do this, there are some facts you really need to consider. So I'm going to give you some pros and cons that go along with choosing to build a doorless or, or even a curbless shower. The pros of a walk-in shower are that it's a luxurious bathroom feature. It looks great. A doorless shower can bring a modern, luxurious look to your bathroom. It offers easy accessibility, a growing trend among older homeowners now, and a walk-in shower without a glass barrier or a threshold makes the bathroom more accessible for people of all ages and with all levels of mobility. It can be a less expensive option. Leaving off the glass door can significantly reduce the cost of installation as long as you don't increase the size of the shower and the amount of tile work in the design that would offset that. However, curbless walk-in showers will typically be more expensive due to the specialty drain and the tile work needed to create the curbless situation. Now you can build a doorless shower and still have a curb, but they don't look as quite as nice as a curbless shower. A doorless shower won't conflict with the entry door to the bathroom, and that's kind of a nice thing so you don't have someone coming out of the shower and someone coming into the bathroom. If you can configure it properly, you can avoid that conflict between the shower door and the door leading into the bathroom. The cons of a walk-in shower are that your, maybe your bathroom is just not big enough, and a proper doorless shower requires a certain amount of space to ensure that water doesn't end up everywhere. And in a small bathroom, even with correctly oriented shower heads, a sloped floor, a perfectly designed drainage system, there's still going to be a little bit of water on the floor and splashing. It also creates a lack of privacy because even with a clear glass door or shield, um, it can pr provide some privacy because of the water droplets or steam that obstruct the view. Choosing a frosted or designer option on the door it isn't always the first choice because you're trying to create an open feeling. Since the point of the shower is to keep things open, probably want to go clear. We've built some walk-in showers that aren't glass and are simply just a tiled wall between you and the rest of the bathroom. If your room is large enough, this can be a great option too. You might get a little chilly. One of the benefits of a shower enclosure is the airflow and the warmth are trapped in the shower. Doorless showers don't offer these same benefits, so if you run cold, um, not having a door in the shower could be a challenge for you. Before you decide to build a doorless walk-in shower, be sure that you contemplate the pros and cons. Please check out our additional videos on YouTube and on our website and be sure to follow us on social media. Thanks for listening.